Today is National Girls and Women in Sports Day, so we thought we would profile a prolific female coach in the area. I knew her as Julie Gessling as a really good player, and now she's Julie Matheny, a successful coach. Just turn her, turn her, turn her, turn her, turn her! Um, I know how badly I hurt when I didn't win. That girl took an extra dribble. You need to recover and you need to get back on that trailer. The ball's in our hands, they can't score. Growing up with, you know, four brothers, it was automatic, you know. I didn't want to just rebound, I was going to play, you know. I was like, I'll take him on. Julie Matheny has taken on everybody in high school basketball over the last quarter of a century. She has her state title and nearly 500 wins. Matheny has been one of the leaders in women's sports in our area. She remembers all too well how she was treated when she played college basketball at SLU in the early 80s. The bands had no heat, you know, like we were scraping the inside of the windows so we could see out the windows. That would never happen in the boys' program. It wouldn't have happened, you know, now it would never happen in the girls' program. At St. Joseph's Academy, the staff never separates. Over the last two decades, it's been Julie, Tim Stock in the middle, and Julie's twin brother, Bobby, on the end. Together, this group has developed an efficient system of basketball that has produced consistent success. And Bobby knows his sister's strengths well. Sincerity, she uh, and caring, she just really cares for the kids. And she wants to then to experience what she experienced. Abby, you gotta get out and stop that. And what would you want one of your players to say on the way out about their experience here? I don't want to leave. <laughs> or how about pay them more? No. <laughs> yes, all high school coaches are underpaid, no doubt For about sure. it. For sure. Yep.